Hello my wintery friends, domination tips, I'm right back for you with exciting news. You can see it at these texture, textures of the uh, wintery trees. Update 5.1 got finally released, we all anticipated it very, I very very bad. And so uh, let's go through it, I will give you a little um, a little guide and to show you all new things which got implemented. So for sure, for first you, we can see it's uh, not only optically uh, implementation of some snow to the trees. But what will be also very awesome, and I also announced it to you, the walls can now be upgraded for gold or either for food. You can decide. And that was the point I anticipated or I waited for the most, the very, very most. But we have also some other quite new things. At the very, very uh, left side of our university, we can see we have two new leaders among or uh, with which we can just uh, research some things. And in total, Hiawacha is very obviously a leader under which leader uh, we only have to search or to research for a very um, little amount of time. All other leaders have um, 100 researches to do. And uh, with Hiawacha, we only have um, 50 researches and there are some kind of split it up. So you can see here we can uh, fi research five times the loot blessing amount or the effectivity and the next five stages are over here. Over here we can research the um, upgrade costs for our walls and gates five times. The next five times are over here. So all of these, uh, quite all of these um, researches are split it up onto two chapters um, so that they are not immediately or not instantly both or the complete research uh, available. We see the loot blessing is getting um, improved by around 1%. This means two times five times one percent in total so ten percent increasing of the amount of loot we can get by activating this blessing also the duration of all um, skills we are researching with food can be upgraded two five times five times by three percent in total uh, so uh, thirty percent we can upgrade the uh, or downgrade let's uh, at least uh, so uh, decrease the amount of gold or either food which is getting uh, not or needed to um, to upgrade our walls and at least our our gates about five times uh, multiplied by two uh, one percent in total ten percent we can do that means if we have a wall of about uh, one million of cost we have a reduction in total if you have researched all about 100,000 gold. If you have a wall which costs 5 million or even 8 million, let's take the last or the highest walls, 8 million, you will save about 800,000 per piece. That's quite huge. Also, we can research um, the farm um, upgrading costs again about uh, two percent only okay that's quite new. So you can see in total you can research I think 10 times no, five times. We can research five times, um, two percent, in total ten percent. Um, again, this is a ch the second part of the chapter for um, duration for food researches over here, which this is the other part. Then we can upgrade or even research, better to say, the uh, amount of costs we have to, to, to do for upgrading our mills. Five times by two percent, so another ten percent. And what we have over here, I'm, I can see, we can not only uh, decrease the duration, but we can also in decrease the costs of all of our food resources, uh, researches. In total, this means all researches which are done by food are very, very much faster and very much cheaper than before. Uh, this is the ch second chapter for our walls and gates and in total we have the last uh, ability which is getting um, um, available if you have researched all other 50 researches and then you get five nations and this means to you um, all university researches which are re getting researched by a food uh, require one less citizen so you have one more citizen for you if you have done this quite awesome I think I'm uh, more focused on the walls than on the upgrades in the university but I'm also very um, happy about the decrease of costs for our walls let's get to the uh, internet page of dominations here we see all patch notes uh, 5.1 update coming soon let it snow 
uh, gifts of peace. So this means winter in dominations, it snowed in dominations, these are only some textures. Wintry gifts appear on the outskirts of your town for the whole month of December. Happy holidays. So like uh, also like in the uh, Korean event before I think there will be some or at the deploy event of Atomic Age there will be some, some crests you can just open. Alliance gifting. Show your alliance how much you care. Specially marked purchases reward everyone in your uh, alliance with a gift. The larger the purchase, the bigger the gift. This means um, if you are getting to the store, I'm quite sure, if you are getting to the store and uh, buy something, you will get some more gifts, but I'm not interested in buying any more. Walls for food by popular demand. <laughs> yes, very right. Level plus, uh, 9 plus walls and gates can be now upgraded for either food or gold. Very nice. Uh, new great leader Hiawacha, we already talked about. Researching Hiawacha skills improves your economy and also reduces the costs and research. Time of university skills that cost food. Hiawacha skills are cheaper and faster to research than other great leaders. Oh, that I missed this point. If we are researching at Hiawacha, it not. The first stage is not costing about one day. It's only costing about two hours. So I think the Hiawacha researches can be done in some weeks probably if you are um, doing it every day when it's finished. Hiawacha's capstone, five nations reduces the number, okay, we have talked about the number of citizens by one to research um, food researches. Additional buildings and upgrades, that's very cool. Upgrade the alliance gate to level 9 for additional troop uh, donation capacity. That, that uh, would, be, would mean uh, quite, I think, about 36, I'm not quite sure, I think you can in Atomic Age now... Uh, Uh, request for 36 alliance troops, that's very huge. Upgrade command post to level 8 for additional war loot and storage uh, and stronger unit defenders, that's quite cool because uh, then it's the actual uh, stage of defenders for the um, equal age. Build an additional market and mill in the atomic age, that's quite awesome because then you can store your resources in four buildings. That means you have to protect more buildings, but on the other way the enemy has very, very more harder to do, even to five star your base with 100% and at least to get all of your resources. Balance updates. Expeditions blessing. Crop, commerce, medic and wall now provide better bonuses when obtained from higher level expeditions. So the blessings you are getting are depending now on the stage of your uh, um, of your dog. The higher your dog is, the better the, uh, the stats of these blessings are. Wall sappers now do full damage to all adjac adjacent wall segments, making them better at opening larger gaps in the enemy walls. Okay, this means that um, wall sappers, um, again, I think in previous stages of dominations it was already, they are really... Uh, exploding at the wall and making more than only one piece of a wall crash one piece of a wall I think I have not tried it but I think they will now give a gap of uh, two probably even three or four wall segments which are getting uh, exploded or destroyed attack helicopters now have a splash damage radius of one making them even better as donated defenders um, oh wow that's really really awesome interesting because our attack helicopters now get splash damage they are quite like uh, some upgraded mk tanks and some artillery probably they are now even better to donate in your town center than artillery wow mm -hmm. that's really huge fighters and expeditions sepoy can now attack helicopters uh I think now ranged infantry and also sepoys from the dock can now attack helicopters. Probably um, before there were some problems with this. I don't have attack helicopters, so I did not recognize any p uh, problems. Performance improvements. New users uh, on older devices will see better performance. Okay. Improved font usage to reduce memory impact. I don't know. General memory improvements. So uh, I think when, it's, when it comes to uh, retrain times, Our retraining times for your for your generals. Bugs fixes and improvements. Fixed a bug that caused the heritage library text to count twice. I don't know. I'm not in the global age. Probably some of you have uh, uh, know what they are talking about. Fixed crash when a castle is destroyed before enemy generals have spawned. Uh, 
Okay. Fix a bug causing a network disconnect when finishing university skills. That, uh, this bug I had sometimes that uh, even some, some of your citizens are still in the university whether it uh, should be ready and there is a minus count below so that you see real university should have finished five minutes ago but it has not and sometimes it also crashed like it stands over here. Fix trap blessing, not rearming traps and add a trap blessing back to the temple. Okay guys, here we have it uh, the the trap blessing got uh, got uh, taken back by the developers now we have it back so it got re-implemented to the game very cool fix bug causing training blessing to increase troop training time this bug i also had uh, sometimes um Hopefully it's better now. Let's see. Fix town center not spawning defenders when attack, attack helicopters are in range. I did, don't have any experiences with this, but obviously uh, attack helicopters in previous times did not correctly uh, trigger the town center. War Academy now properly displays current tactics count. That's also really cool because before sometimes you had the problem that you have trained 11 from uh, a total of 5 um tactics in total level 4 fort defenders now fire bullets instead of arrows ah really cool ah that's really cool probably we have now uh, the current the the right equal defenders on all um, forts only a little uh, side notice Ah, uh, no, it don't looks like. Uh, the problem was that our defenders at our castle are always two ages below the stage of the castle. My castle is upgraded to industrial max. So, uh, industrial towers, I have enlightenment towers. At enlightenment towers, there you have enlightenment troops. But at the industrial castle, you only have gunpowder troops. And so in the global castle, you have enlightenment troops. And it, in the atomic castle, you will get industrial troops. And that's very buggy. But... Um, It, um, Dominations now tells us that also the defenders which are getting from the castle shoot uh, wrong missiles or wrong projectiles. Now they are shooting bullets instead of arrows, so li only a little increase. Next point we, are, we want to go through. Uh, fixed event notifications triggering at the wrong time or with garbled messages. Um, that problem I only had one time, so the event was uh, showed to be... Um, to be finished when it was quite not but that was quite no big problem i think fixed a bug causing extraneous symbols in the alliance names that we had sometimes when someone has uh, applied or even when someone wanted to come in our alliance we had some strange symbols in our chat various fixes to attack and defense replays okay hopefully we'll see it probably it will not crash that often security improvements and art fixes and text edits really cool guys in total i could uh, i wish i could uh, help you with my informations tell me how what you think about the new update will you research for here watcher we'll see you soon your domination tips <laughs>